In this video, I'm going to show you how to make the interactions look a little bit more realistic by having the bot delay its responses. The problem with the sort of instant response is it looks a bit too cold and it reminds the person interacting with your bot that they are dealing with a, a bit of software and it takes some of the fun out of it. So just to make that slightly more kind of human uh, interaction, what we want is to delay the response and to show the person that the, the bot is actually composing a reply. You don't want nothing happening because they might think the bot stalled. So we've got this little feature here, it's very useful. Go to chat bubbles in your interaction, so it's up there above the text, pick delayed response rather than instant response. And what happens is you get an automatic bit of uh, code there at the end for you, where each X is, a, is a, a, a length of pause. So if you want a really long pause, you can stick in a few more Xs, but we've got four for you there, and that's normally perfectly adequate. That's all there is to it. It has a little nice little delay on it. Now, if we test it, there we go. Did you see the little there? Uh, just the, the thing scrolling and we'll do that again there we go so you, you the bot is is not just instantly responding it's sort of looks like it's thinking there's one other thing i want to show you about this as well which is that you can do the same uh delay if you're using um cards as well so say you, you'd put in an image or a bit of text you can use the delay function here to give that same kind of effect so two is normally ideal and off you go that's it